Good afternoon everyone. This is Archana from MC Public School of Class 10 and today I am here to discuss about polynomials. So first of all, uh, th I am thanking my teachers to give me this wonderful opportunity to express my views on this wonderful topic that is polynomial. So let us have a look what are the overview of this chapter polynomial. First of all, overview are the definition of this polynomial, coefficient of polynomial, degree of polynomial, characteristics of polynomial and zeros of polynomial means we are going to discuss all this subtopics of this chapter polynomials so let's begin so let's begin with what is polynomial so polynomial is an algebraic expression in which the variable involved has non negative integral exponent so polynomial is an algebraic expression expression in which the variable the variable involved has non negative integral exponent so a polynomial is an algebraic expression in which the variable involved has non negative integral exponent so what does this non negative integral means non negative means the values which are not negative so we can say the positive values are non negative and integral means the numbers which are not written in decimal form so for example we can say 0 1 2 and etc are the non negative integral let's take an example here 4x square minus 2y plus 2z i have taken this an example of polynomial i said that this example is polynomial because here as per as a definition we know that the variable involved has non negative integral exponent here the variable is x and the non negative integral exponent is 2 here the non negative integral exponent is 1 and the z x the power of z is also 1 so let us understand what is coefficient of the polynomial to understand the coefficient of a polynomial let's again take an example coefficient means the the value which is just next to the variable means the value beside the variable are known as the coefficient of the polynomial so if you are asked what is the coefficient of x in this equation the the coefficient of this x is 2 so here coefficient is 2 now as we are clear with now we are clear with the definition and coefficient of the polynomial now we will look what are the degrees of the polynomial so degree of polynomial so degree of polynomial is the highest value of as a highest power of the variable highest highest power of the variable so for understand this more easy easily so let's take an example 9y square minus 9y plus 
here this is a I have taken a polynomial and if we are asked what is the degree of this polynomial so as I, as I said that the highest power of the variable is known as the degree so here the highest power of the variable so what is the variable here variable is y and the highest power is 2 so the degree of this polynomial will be 2 so I hope that this uh, you will understand what is degree so let's move to another topic that is types of degrees or we can say types of polynomials so we will learn types of polynomial on the basis of degrees and on the basis of terms so sorry on the basis of degree and another type of polynomial we will know that on the basis of terms so let us understand types of degrees on the basis of uh, sorry let us understand the types of polynomial on the basis of degrees so there are four types of polynomials on the basis of degrees so first one is linear polynomial second one is quadratic polynomial third one is uh, cubic polynomial and fourth one is biquadratic polynomial so second one is uh, quadratic polynomial third one is cubic polynomial And fourth one is biquadratic polynomial. So, as we know that types of polynomial on the basis of degrees are linear polynomial, quadratic polynomial, cubic polynomial, and biquadratic polynomial. Let us know about is uh, the on the basis of degree types of polynomial deeply. So, first is linear polynomial. These are on the basis of degree. So, linear polynomial is a uh, type of polynomial whose uh, the power is the one or we can say whose highest power or simple or in simple words whose degree is one so a polynomial whose is one so, a type of polynomial whose degree is 1 is known as linear polynomial. For example, 4x plus 2. Let us take this example. Here, the degree is 1. How we can say? As I said, uh, that the degree is the highest power of the variable. Here, the, the variable is x and the highest power of this variable is 1 so we can say the degree is 1 
Now, let us understand what is quadratic polynomial. So, quadratic polynomial is a type of polynomial whose degree is 2. Degree is degree is 2. For example, for example, 3x square minus 2x plus 1 is a quadratic polynomial. How, how can I say that this is a quadratic polynomial? Because the, poly, the, the uh, degree of this polynomial is 2. Here the variable is x and the highest power of this variable is 2. So we can say the degree is 2 of this polynomial. Now let us understand what is cubic polynomial. Cubic polynomial. So, the cubic polynomial is a type of polynomial whose degree is 3. Here, degree is 3. For, for example, 2x cube minus 9x square minus 9x plus 1. So, this is an example of cubic polynomial because the degree of this polynomial is 3. Now, let us understand what is biquadratic polynomial. Biquadratic polynomial. So, the biquadratic polynomial is a type of polynomial whose degree is 4. So, here the degree is 4. Okay. For example, 13x raised to the power 4 minus plus 2x raised to the power 3 plus 1 sorry x raised to the power 2 minus x plus 5. Here this is an example of biquadratic polynomial because the degree of this polynomial is 4. Okay, let's move to the another topic that is on the basis of terms. Types of polynomial on the basis of terms. So, on the basis of terms, on the basis of terms, there are three types of polynomial. First one is binomial, oh, sorry, second one is trinomial. Third one is quadrinomial. Quadrinomial, trinomial and polynomial are the types of polynomial on the basis of terms. So, to remember this, what is binomial, trinomial, quadrinomial, there is a quick trick that is by, if you see the term by, here tri and here quadri. Bi means 2, tri means 3 and quadri means 4 and as you, as you know that nomial means terms here, yeah. nomial means terms. So we can say that binomial is a type of polynomial whose uh, have two terms. Now the trinomial has three terms and the quadrinomial has four terms. So Let's take an example of this binomial terms are 4x plus 2y trinomial 2x plus 3y plus 2 and 
quadrinomial. Two x plus three y plus three z minus two. Here, these are the examples of binomial, trinomial, and quadrinomial because it has two terms, one and two. Here, three terms, one, two, and three. Here, four terms, one, two, three, four. Now, let us know what are these terms. Terms. Terms are the non-zero part of a polynomial. which is separated by plus and minus operations. Now here terms are the non-zero part of a polynomial which is separated by the this plus and minus operations. How I can say for example let's take this here this is the plus operation and the terms are 1 and 2 terms. So let us move to our next topic that is 0 of the polynomial, 0 of a polynomial. Zero of the polynomial are the types of polynomial in which if we put the value of the variable uh, and the, then the remainder becomes zero. For example, no, sorry, I have right that the variable, the value of the variable which the value of the variable, the value of the variable when, when we put that value of variable the remainder is 0. So, the 0 of the polynomial or a type of polynomial is when the when we put the value of the variable which is given in the question then the re remainder becomes 0. So, that is all for today. Thank you.